Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Outlaws of the Old West. I'm the Radio Man 03, and it's awesome to have you along. I bought the train station. I figure it's a good place to start. If I thought to myself, okay, if I put the train station down, then everything I build can kind of build around it, next to it, and up near to it, and stuff like that. So I'm kind of curious to see what it looks like so that we can kind of start building our town around that. So all we got to do is place that thing. So um, I'm going to get out of that view. I'm going to get out of that view. Uh, and I'm hoping that I can put it right in this area right here and it's going to fit it's huge I did pull it up in my inventory once already and it's really difficult to see what you're doing um, but I feel like that looks pretty good right there I'm trying to see the foundation the foundation doesn't look bad I'm hoping that that's gonna be okay and that we're gonna be able to go into town nice and straight so I'm gonna go ahead and place it right there looks like we did it it's not quite right this is the track here though okay so if we come off the track here oh perfect all right so we can bend it a little bit if we need to this is the start so actually look at that that's not too bad we're gonna probably have to bend it a little bit but what does what does it take to make the track oh I've got to get the uh, the correct tool I think for the job we can go in here huh yeah I'm hoping Ooh. Buy engine. Oh, a thousand bucks. Buy cargo on slot one. Oh, 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 oh. Wow. Okay. That's pretty cool. You could buy. Oh, oh my gosh. Buy an engine. We got a ticket guy over here, too. Uh, same thing. Okay. So there we go. All right. Very awesome. Well, I think we placed it pretty darn good. Gets high down on this end, but that's okay. Can we grab that rock? Let's leave the rock right there. It's all right. Okay, this is going to work. Ooh, this is close right here. But for the most part, I'd say we did pretty well in placing this. It's a little too much that way. But I think we can work around that. I think we can. Now, what do I need for... What do I need to... Uh, there's a certain tool I have to have in order to make that. I guess this went under the ground a little bit here, didn't it? That's like for livestock and horses, though, so there would be dirt and stuff right here. You know, you bring them up and you put them in there, get them on the train. Yeah, okay. Uh, so that's okay to have a little bit of dirt on that. Let's get back to Ace. I pretty much got it where I wanted it. If I'd gone any further this way, this would be this is this end of it would have started getting buried. Yeah, that's gonna work out just great. All right, so what do I need for the? Uh, so all this has to basically come down, and we have to we'll we'll, re, we'll do some rearranging of things. It'll work out just great. It's gonna work out just great. We get to be a little spontaneous with our buildings. I've seen the modular buildings put side by side, and I didn't think they looked all that like they were supposed to fit together side by side. They just don't seem to go together very well. Um, each one has kind of a different kind of bottom to it. What am I doing back here? I'm looking for... There's, there's a tool for the train station. Uh, I'm just getting on. Just got done doing Citadel Forge with Fire. Uh, train, there's a, there's a sledgehammer. I did the shovel, you guys. I've got it in the chest here. It does absolutely nothing at the moment that I can tell. The trowel is for the brick. A metal town bell. I know I've, I, I, I'm pretty sure I've seen a tool that is supposed to be the one that you use for that. Uh, let me grab the shovel real fast so you guys can see that. It looks great and all, but yeah, you really can't do anything with it. He holds it uh, well, like so. And really all you can do is... Um, that's left click. Right click does nothing. So even if you like go over to dirt and stuff... Uh, I'm going to go over here just in case for some reason I screwed it up last time and now it's going to work. I never go through here, so let's do this. Yeah, see, he just swings. He won't dig into the dirt. So, I don't know. I don't know, maybe it's something for the future. Coming coming soon. 
to Outlaws of the Old West nearest you, some kind of thing like that. Uh, we're going to go ahead and put that back. We're going to take it out of our hands. Put it back there. And then we saw the ranch. We built the water tower with that the other day, yesterday. Uh, oh, I also mentioned, I forgot to mention I, I made a belt as well. And throw that in there, throw that in there. We got some meat. I'll tell you what, I'm going to take a break. I'm going to find out what I need to do for the rails instead of making you guys watch. And then we'll, uh, we'll proceed forward with what we're going to do. Welcome back. I need the hammer that's inside the actual train station, the rail hammer. I need 500 bucks. I have 157. So, I can't get the rail hammer to try the rail hammer out unless I go to the mine and I spend time down there getting the gold out of the mine and then we sell it off. That's 500 bucks if I get all of that gold. I don't have to have all of it, but a lot of it would be nice to have. So, I can't do the rail just yet, but I need to actually, I would really like to do the rail because once I get it started, I can kind of bend it and shape it to the way I want it to be. Let's hope the train station shows up. I did log out for a second. Hello? There it is. Oh, thank God. So, yeah, inside here come the Mallards. Coming in for their evening uh, pass at the house here. Afternoon, I guess, now. Yeah. So, what we need to do is buy this guy right here. 500 bucks. Oh, boy. Okay, so, I'm going to have to take Jimmy over to the mine, up on the hill there, and we're going to have to get Jimmy hooked up, and I'm going to have to go down the mine, shotgun and all that good stuff, and however stuff the gold so we get the money to buy that hammer, because I really need to get at least a few pieces of that laid just so I can kind of get started. Uh, so let's put Ace inside the barn, and we will grab uh, little Jimmy. And I'm going to have to run over there and get to work. Because, yeah, there's a lot. That's, a, that's, oopsie, whoa. A bit of lag there. Little Jimmy. Little Jimmy. Excuse me. There we go. There we go. There we go. All right. All right, guys. I'm going to go back to the mine. Get down in there. I'll, I'll bring you back, show you some of the action, all that good stuff down the mine. Because it's always fun. You know, you got the, the old timers down there causing trouble. I've gone crazy with, uh, you know, they're delirious. Just delirious. So I'll be back. platform in here this time. You said that the uh, mines would be random when it spawned back in. Each time I spawn out and come back in, the mine resets and it's a little something different. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay. Alright, so you don't get used to the same thing over and over again. Oh, I'm close to back at the beginning again, I think. All I did was grab up the gold. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so... I got a little bit more gold right here, but it's not a whole lot. Sorry, I did turn the gamma up. I wanted to see, kind of see what it was like to be down here uh, without the gamma turned up. And it's it's a little bit darker, that's for sure. The 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 lighting is is most definitely different, um, and it's got a really cool feel to it. It, it has a very miney feel. The way the lights kind of flicker and glow and stuff, I like that. Let's see how this uh, exit goes for us. I don't think I have enough gold in order to get uh, what you call it. Let's see. Okay, it's, it's, there it goes. Okay, so now it's reading the building. Okay, so it takes a second for it to read the building. I'm kind of curious as to where Jimmy will stop if I tell him to stop, like right now. Does he automatically go to one place? Detach the donkey. He still thinks he's walking. Yep, yeah, he's, he's definitely glitched. 
Maybe what we could do is put them back up here. Attach him and detach him again. Let's try that and see if he doesn't snap out of that. Hmm. Okay, that's not working. Yeah, okay, he's he looks like he's uh Oh boy. Let's see if he's detached or not. He is, but he's he's definitely broken. So I'm gonna take him home, put him in the barn, I'm gonna log out and log back in, and then what we're gonna do is we're going to uh whoop. Jeez, are you kidding me? <laughs> Pronghorn just ran right into me. Crazy animal. And uh we'll uh we'll resume from there, but yeah, he thinks he's still poor guy. He's just so dedicated to walking that circle that uh he's uh you know, he's broken. <laughs> so I'll be back in just a second. That fixed little Jimmy right up. Fixed him right up. Just by logging out and coming back in. It was perfect. Just perfect. Let's grab Ace. Let's bring him on down here. I've got smelting to do now. I've got to get all this gold that we just got. And get it fired up in here. Let's see here. How much do we have? I say craft all. Okay, so let's go ahead and escape out of there. Let's go back in. Uh, no control and click. Control and click, right, to remove all of that. There we go. And then I could say I want 15 here. Enter and ignite. And then we can do the rest of them right over here. Ignite. There we go. So I'm going to wait for that to happen. I guess I could put even some of them in here, huh? I could. I could do that. It would speed things up a little bit. So let's go ahead and go... Let's take a little bit out of there. And we'll take a little bit out of here. And then we'll go over here. We'll tell it how many to do. Craft all. Ignite. There we go. Alright, beautiful. Alright, I'll be back when the gold is done. We'll see how much we have. I don't think it's enough. I think I'm going to have to go back in the mine several more times. So, we might be a little dead in the water in terms of getting some rail put down for, uh, you know, the... Uh, the train station out there that hopefully is still uh, <laughs> still there. I'll be back. Thought of something we could do while we're waiting for that gold to uh, cook up. I made the uh, outhouse just because uh, it sounds like it'd be fun to do. <laughs> so I made the outhouse. Let's go ahead and see what we've got going on here for this thing. Uh, maybe right behind the house here, right? I mean, this is where we'd, we we don't want to travel too far. When we've got to go, you got to go, right? Uh, but I guess you wouldn't want it too close to the house because the uh, the smell would be just horrible. Uh, this seems like really far away and it doesn't look like it's actually going onto the ground very well. What if I were to do it like this? Sideways? Oh, they just want to hover so much above the ground. I just don't want it to do that. I want it to look good. Because it's gonna push the it's gonna push that grass away is what it's gonna do. What if I go over here? Put it kind of right here. Ah, it's still above the ground, huh? Can I move this? I can move it. Okay, that's good. Um. How's that look right there? It's a little bit better. I'll... I might work on it some more. Can we do anything with this? Just move and destroy, huh? Okay. Alright. There we go. You can't, even, you can't even close the door either. Okay, it's just... it just sits open. But there's the outhouse. We should probably have a second one out here, down in this area here. But yeah, look at that. It's sitting way up off the ground like that. I just don't like that at all. Ugh. Troubles. Outhouse troubles, man. I am going to put it right here because it looks to me like it's going to fit pretty good. And yeah, you're right. The, the smell would be awful, but there there we go. It's 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 mostly in the ground right here and whatever. <laughs> it looks better than it did sitting over there where it was floating in the air. 
I guess there's a possibility we could have stuck it out somewhere in the front yard here too, kind of a happy medium, but I just don't see me running out the front door to go use the bathroom. That would be kind of weird. Uh, take all and extinguish. There we go, we got those. Take all, extinguish. And take all. There we go, beautiful. All right, let's auto stack. 34, oh boy. 34 is all we got. That's it, 34. Ace, let's go see a guy about selling some gold. And what do we, I can't remember what we had up in the house, a hundred and some odd bucks. And then I just got a little bit off the miners too, so not a whole lot, not a whole lot. But maybe we could scrape together the 500 to get that hammer. And then I can at least see what the cost is for some of the materials. I'm pretty sure the rails are probably pretty expensive. None of this, by the way, is set in stone. This is just something I can put in my head and kind of start, you know, looking at and get ideas from. Uh, sell. All 34. Sell. 377. Oh, boy. I need at least 130 plus at the house. Let's go. Trusty Steed Ace speeds us to the home. Most he's had to run in ever. Nice work, Ace. All right, let's, uh, let's see what we've got in our safe upstairs. Oh, turn these lights on every time I come in. I just turn on the ones that I feel like we're going to be using the most. And I've turned these on several times today. <laughs> oh, by the way, I did move the chimneys up. Oh, withdraw. One, five, seven, three, two. Oh, boy. $34. Oh my god. Let's put $34.37 back in. Oh my god. Okay. $34.37. Deposit. Oh, that took all of it. So let's just withdraw $500. There we go. Okay. God, now I wonder, does the hammer, you know die after a period of time it was going to cost me another 500 bucks down the road that's that's cool if it does I, i'm not worried about it i'm not worried about that at all oh i was going to show you the chimneys hold on one of you pointed out raise your chimneys please wasn't sure if i was going to be able to do it one more time but i did i raised the stone one up one more time i think it's about level now with the top of the roof which is great and i even raised this one up too those guys tend to stick out a little bit anyways i have a wood stove in my house and the pipe sticks way up in the air so that the uh, air can get to it to you know do that little backdraft inside to, to keep it burning so it's nice it's nice real nice and warm very nice and warm indeed mm-hmm all right um okay let's go see a railroad about a railroad hammer a real hammer next stop train station onward ace should like that pawn down there i'm gonna be real careful with what i do when i move forward from here just to, to kind of you know take it easy and, and make sure i do things right but i think it's going to turn out pretty good i like where the rail station laid it should be okay well, i'd like it if it's a little more even but the ground isn't like that here and that's pretty good it's all got all four corners under the ground which i'm pretty happy with was that a, an american badger no nope, it's not it's an American rock. Okay, so I want to buy the rail hammer. Did I do it? Not enough money. Okay, so... Um... Oh, wow. I didn't feel like I could get out of there. There it is, right there. Okay, so let's put him down on number one. Oh, hold on, everybody. I'm hungry. I'm starving to death here. Give me that. Give me this. Give me some of that water too. Oh, delicious water. Okay, so B, number one. What do we need? Straight rail, curved right rail, curved left rail. For a straight rail, I need iron bars, planks, stone, and sand. Oh, wow. Planks, stone, and sand. Planks, stone, and sand. Planks. Oh my god, that sounds like a bear. Sounds like a huge bear. Go, Ace. Go, Ace. Oh my god, that sounds like a huge bear. 
Ace is not running very fast. Why is not why is Ace not running faster? Oh my god, he's right behind me. He's so big. Oh dear lord, get me away from that grizzly bear. I know it's a grizzly bear. It's gotta be a grizzly bear. Oh my goodness. Sorry, Ace, I'd sacrifice you if I had to to survive an attack of a grizzly bear. Oh. Where is it? <gasps> What's Ace? Oh, come on, he's got to be here somewhere. He chased me right through here. He didn't give up right away. Oh, that's weird. Okay, that's just weird. I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Stone. Said something about stone. Oh my god. That scared the crap out of me. Um... I've got 108 planks, so I've got some planks on me. Stone, oh my god, that just freaked me out. Okay, I thought I was a dead man. I thought he was going to eat me. Uh, straight rail, iron bars, planks, stone, and sand. So I've got the stone now, too. Oh, iron bars. That's what I'm going to need is iron bars. Let's grab those. Um, oh, I've got them on my inventory. Beautiful. Beautiful. I love it so much. I do. And let's throw that in there. Let's sort those items. Auto stack it. There we go. That's a little bit cleaner. Uh, there was a comment about not taking the saddles off the horses in the last episode. I agree. I would love to take the horses off the saddle uh, each time I brought them back. I would do that and put them in a chest. Because horses wouldn't stand around with their saddles on like that. Um, but with them disappearing and things just being kind of weird, I just don't feel like making saddles every single day. Uh, so, I kind of leave them on. They're not breaking so I, I like them very much because if my horse doesn't have a saddle I don't feel as absorbed in the game as I do when they have a saddle so I'm gonna wait till the Sun comes up so we go down there and do this right in the daylight and we're gonna go ahead and probably hammer in at least a couple pieces of track and fiddle around with those things down there so I'll be right back I'm just gonna fire up some lights here too oh we gotta get this going as well there we go cook up that meat cook up that meat there we go. Beautiful. Be right back. I could place a few. Looks like it's going to start going uphill right away. Which is a little unfortunate, I'll admit. Can't do too many. Yeah, you can see I'm headed right for the pond here. So, what if I do... Right here. How far are we out of the station here? Just a little bit. Do that right there. I'm pretty sure I'm just about out of stuff. One more here. And then I'm going to need to go start going this way nope still gotta go one more right and I'm out I'm out of resources for this so this is gonna get me kind of where I want to be it's probably gonna cut this way but I can remove these and get it figured out what I can do also right now is do I have my wood hammer on me I do and I've got some stone and a little bit of wood on me right there so let's go ahead and auto stack and sort that yeah we burned through the iron ingots pretty quick that's for sure so okay so we come out of the train station we're gonna have to do a little bit of a curve coming out of it which is just fine uh, there should be a water tower uh, next to this as well I don't like the fact that we're going uphill so much but you know, what are we going to do? This is where it placed. It's a thousand dollars. I can't just pick it up and, you know, put it back down again. At least I don't think I can, right?
Change track to manage. No, never mind. Uh, okay. Um, so from here... I really should have the a couple of straight pieces in. But now I can kind of sit here and do something like this and figure out, you know, where I can put some structure... Okay, so it wants to have all that right there. Yeah, I'm going to need at least a couple straight pieces so I can get these guys lined up on either side of it. And then these will be my, kind of my form uh, foundations to kind of run along here to just keep, keep in line. And then eventually what we'll do is we're going to branch off to the left a little ways, off to the right a little ways, and then we'll have the train kind of going through, I guess, what will be the center of town. And we'll see if we can. It was suggested that the rails kind of go along this wall right here since it sits so high. And then the train would be kind of level with that. But I think the train would actually go up a little higher than that even. So I don't know. Um, but we'll wait until we get there and, and see what it looks like. This is kind of strange looking right here. It sure is sits up on high on a, on a gravel thing. Yeah, that looks a little odd. There's even a yellow thing in there. I wonder why it does that. I guess they all have that little yellow line in there. Hmm. Interesting. We say that because we don't know what it means. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. All right. Train station. Um, I was going to get started on the Smithy, uh, or the I guess it's the livery stable is what it's called. Uh, but uh, I thought the train station might not be a bad way to get going here. And then we can kind of feed off of that for the town because it is a nice building. I kind of wish it didn't have the uh, the gas street lamps on it. I wish it would be left up to us. And actually, I wish I could build my own train station, to be quite honest with you. But that's okay. It sits out there. We're going to have it come right through here. It looks to me like it's almost lined up to come right through. Right down here is what it will wind up doing. So that's that's gonna if it does, that's going to work out great. And we can build around it and have some fun with it. And it's going to be a good time. So I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, do hit that like button for me. Comment, subscribe, and share. I'm the Radio Man 03. I want you to have an awesome, a fantastic, and a superb day. And I look forward to talking to you again next time.